Hey everybody, this is another uh, Baffles Me review. I'm Sir Harry, as you probably know already. Uh, this will be my 4,000th review this week. No, I'm just kidding. Um, so I'm reviewing the Ultra Pro graded card sleeves resealable. So there's a little sticky tab at the top. It's hard to see these pictures. But basically what I use these bags for us, I'll show you. I get the cards graded from PSA and they come in these hard plastic cases. But they can get scratched. You can stack because you stack them on top of each other. So what I like to do is I like to use these soft plastic bags, basically, to go over those cases, and that's these. Uh, they work well. They st and there's little grooves on the PSA cases, uh, so the uh, the hard cases can kind of sit on top of each other. Uh, but again, I don't like the fact that they can get scratched. So what I do is I put them in these these little bags first. And then stack them. They, the grooves still fit in there. Less likely to scratch the hard cases. It's just more about being particular with me. Because I purchased graded cards before. And the case, whether it's BGS or PSA. And I've seen these cases, these hard cases get... I mean, look like they were drug across concrete. So I try to keep my stuff um, pretty neat. I mean, as far as... Re especially, you know, you're most likely going to hold on to these cards for a while. Before they're worth any kind of money. You know, you want to protect them the best you can. Like, this, say, for instance, this card right now is worth like 15, 20 bucks. And this, if this, uh, if Zach Collins goes on to do anything, he's actually going to start this year. But if he goes on to do anything, you know, I don't want the case to be all beat up if I go to resell this card in 10, 20 years, let's say. That's just me. So, anyway, cases work as described. Uh, I'll be giving them five stars. I like the fact they're a little bit bigger because you can also use these bags for like bulk common cards. If you want to sell them on eBay or whatever, you can bag them up, write little notes on the outside of these bags. They're, I like the fact they're bigger than the case. I don't want them to be snug on these, honestly. I want, because uh, the goal is to protect the hard case. I don't want some snug fit thing where um, it doesn't have any protection. These are these are pretty thick material. I mean, honestly, they're, they're really good for protecting the, the Beckett or the PSA graded cards. Uh, I'm a fan, so... Anyway, that's what I use them for. As you can see on the outside of this great card, uh, this is the bag here that I purchased. Um, it covers the hard case. There's a little, a little uh, sticky uh, sleeve at the top. You peel off, and then you can seal it permanently. Sometimes I use it. Sometimes I don't. The main goal is just to uh, protect this card uh, from getting to protect the case. I should say the card's protected inside the hard case. What I'm trying to do with these bags is protect the hard plastic case from getting scratched up. I mean, I get it that it's in a hard plastic case. The card's going to be fine. But at the same time, I want it to look nice when I go to resell it. So that's my goal. Anyway, uh, so that's why I bought them for five stars all the way. I'll be leaving that right now. Uh, five star review. Uh, not a whole lot of bells and whistles with this product. Um... Like I said, it's a plastic bag with a little sticky peel thing at the top. You can use them for to protect your graded cards. You can use them to sell bulk commons. If you want to stack, put a stack of like 50 cards in there, you can probably fit about 50. I'd say 25 to 50 cards in one of these bags, seal it up, ship it out, uh, put it in a bubble mailer, and all your cards are in a nice little baggie. So you can use them for a bunch of different things. Uh, but that's why. But the reason I use them is to protect the cases of the graded cards. I hope you enjoyed the review. If you have any questions, leave me a comment below. If you'd like me to review something else, leave me a comment. I'll do my best. And if you could, before you leave today, uh, check my profile out on Amazon. Hit the follow button. Uh, check out my social network here. Also, um, I know I'm, I'm going to keep preaching about this because I think it's important. Uh, I just found out about Amazon Smile. Now I have a nonprofit, which is the only reason I found out about Amazon Smile because we are approved through Amazon Smile as a IRS approved charity. Um, mostly everything I'm doing this year is going to benefit charity in some way. Uh, these reviews are going to help build the YouTube channel, uh, help build my Amazon profile up, um, and like I said, uh, things like that, social network um, profiles, things like, of that nature. So my goal is to uh, let everyone know about this. But Amazon Smile basically, uh, Amazon takes. 0.5% of your purchase and donates it to a charity of your choice. You don't have to be my charity, but it doesn't cost you anything for Amazon Smile. So please, 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 if you do anything else, even if you hate my reviews, you hate my voice, whatever, get set up, click on this link, 
set up with a charity. It doesn't matter if it's mine. Support any charity. It doesn't cost you anything. Your promo codes still work. Your prices don't change. Your rewards don't change. All this does is allows 0.5% uh, of your purchase to be given to a charity of your choice. You get to choose the charity. As long as it's an IRS approved charity, it's probably a part of Amazon Smile. So you better to support veterans, autism, cerebral palsy, cancer, whatever. Support something because it doesn't cost you anything. Amazon, uh, it's less than 1% they'll give to, of your purchase to a charity of your choice. Uh, everyone should be doing this. I'm kicking myself that the last couple years of my purchases didn't go, nothing went towards charity through Amazon Smile, and I regret that. So I didn't know about it. So I'm hoping uh, you learned something today as well. Have a great day, guys. Again, I uh, hope you enjoyed the review. The card sleeves are great. Uh, leave me a comment if you want me to review something else.